YouTube, what's up? Alright, hey guys, my name is Mason. Uh, today, uh, I'm going to be playing Sp Skyrim. Fairly old game. But today, I'm going to be doing a little something I, I think I made up. Um, so, I mean, like, here's my guy. This is actually my very first Skyrim guy ever to be created. I have, like, five or six, probably. But, uh, this is, this is the guy that I very first started with. And, um, I'm just gonna go back to him and use it for this series. But, um, basically this series is gonna be all about, um, basically this guy, you know, has the best house in the game. He has a house in solitude. He has all kind he has hordes amount of stuff. Just a bunch of weapons, you know, soul gems, enchantments, all kinds of stuff. Tons of gold, um, the best art, you know, just all the best stuff. And... Basically, in this series, what I'm going to do is I'm going to have the guy sort of go on an lighted mint trip. <laughs> but yeah, he's going to be going like on a little journey by himself. And I guess he's sort of trying to find enlightenment. enlightenment. He's trying to just find himself, I guess. Because he went through, you know, the Dark Brotherhood. Um, he went through, you know, uh, the war. He went through all kinds of stuff. And he just doesn't know who he is. So I think with this series, is he's going to go off and journey by himself and leave everything behind. He's taking no weapons, no armor, nothing. He's literally going in with rags on his back. He's leaving his wife, his house, everything just going to be leaving behind. And we're going to live off the land, pretty much. And it's going to be set... Difficulty is going to be set on. We're not gonna go mat. We're not gonna go on legendary because that's a little too too much. I would say reasonably we will go on. We'll go on expert and see how that goes. If it's a little too easy, then we'll go up to master. So we're gonna go on uh, expert. We're gonna start off on that. Alrighty. So, first things first, we need to get him back to his house. So that's what we're going to do. I, s I think speci specifically this guy, he's not very good at Magicka. So I don't think I'm going to have that upper hand. So. And I, I think this guy, this guy I have here, I prefer not to use Magicka with him. Because he doesn't have, you know, many spells, I believe. I'm not sure. If I remember right, he doesn't have very many spells. He is like level 99 with like one handed though, pretty sure. Alright, so here we are. Uh, sweet, sweet home town of solitude. Sorry guys, I'm still trying to kind of get used to the controls. I haven't played Skyrim in a while. I'm used to like Minecraft and Call of Duty. <sighs> so I have not been on Skyrim in a while. So let me get back to my house. Wow, stamina is not very good with this guy. And yeah, technically this is my first um, recording of a uh, gameplay video. I'm going main mainstream. I'm the I'm the guy that makes you know like fancy, um, fancy skits and fancy videos and stuff. And I've never really played game. I've never played like video games for YouTube. Um, but yeah, this is my first time. I honestly love Skyrim, so <clears throat> I'm starting off with Skyrim. I'll probably be doing different games, though. I'll probably um, I have I have the N64. I got the Wii. I got the GameCube. I got an uh, Xbox. I got all kinds of old-fashioned games I would like to play. I just gotta get the certain wires for it. All right, here we are. So all right, I'm gonna take a little tour of my uh, of my house. What I have so far. You, you can just. Like, I'll just go in this random cupboard and see what I have. I have tons of... Yeah, it looks like I remember. I I'm starting to remember now. I, ha I sorted out, like, my arrows and stuff that I keep. In this cabinet, I just ha have all my potions. And, yeah, I just stored all my potions in here. And I got some other random stuff. I got some bows in here, but they're not very good bows. And I always decorated my house. I always laid books and stuff around. This is where, I guess, all the food would be kept over here. I'll just lay this stuff out over here. Got some stuff laid out over here. I just really like, when I play this game, I just really like decorating everything. It's got a notch pickaxe over there. Potions and stuff set up everywhere. 
Um, I mean, I organize a lot of stuff too. You can see all kinds of um, got rubies, sapphire, garnets. Let's see here. In here, I believe is potion ingredients. Let's check that though. Yep, I sorted all my potion ingre uh, potion ingredients in here. Okay, I have like everything you can think of in there. And I put all my like ebony ores and ingots and stuff over here. You've got like a pickaxe and stuff. So let's take it. Let's go downstairs first. Downstairs, I got all my weapons sorted up there. I remember I named that Black Run. I used to use that sort of a lot. Um, let's see. Let's take a little venture in here. We got some stuff on the, uh, you know. Got some stuff ever not too not too big of a deal. Oh, I remember that champions. Oh wow, that that's a good weapon right there. You guys need to look into that. It's a very good weapon. Got the enchantment table. Oh yeah, this brings back memories. Got some bows. What I really like is my favorite part of the house is right here. Look at that. Isn't that that's beautiful? I always lay these around because I just think they're so you know they decorate the house and make it just more colorful and bright and stuff like that. I've got some weapons in there. Here's my um, brewing station. Set some potions up. I got tons of stuff in here. And here's here's look at this. And what I meant earlier about hoarding, this is what I mean. Look at that. I just put all my random weapons and armor and staffs and shields, all my stuff in here. So yeah. So I guess that's just pretty much a breakdown of the house. We'll go upstairs here real quick. I even set these things out. Yep, on the table. Oh man, I got I just got this stuff laying out. <laughs> Somebody just come in here and steal it. We'll come in here, let's see what I have in here. Yeah, I just got all um kinds of uh jewelry. That's that's a good that's a good cabinet. I don't really have anything in here, do I? I never really care for books in Skyrim, they're so pointless. I think honestly. Searching chest. This is like yeah, this is where I put all my armor and stuff in here. You can just see the mass amount of stuff I have. I just never get rid of stuff. I hoard it. I'm kinda like that in real life, but not to like this extent. Like I, I like whenever I clean my room up, you know, I get rid of the necessary stuff, like, you know, just stupid stuff I don't need, but you know, if it, it has a little bit of meaning 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 to it in life, I just don't want to get rid of it. It's just how I am. Here's some more armor and random uh, stuff and weapons. And I remember for specifically, I wore this armor when I killed uh, Ulfric Stormcloak. And so I just laid it out here just so people would just see it. I got some um, scrolls. Uh, let's see what's down here. Uh, just a bunch of useless stuff. Let's put down there, I guess. Mirak sword, ebony mace. You know, this is just the basic stuff. You know, I never, the re I have like six different accounts, so like I never, I don't really have a dominant account. So I mean, like I, ha this guy's pretty good. He has a lot of different stuff, you know. But I mean, like he's not like crazy good, you know. I, I bet people would comment on this video like, "Oh, dude, you know I have dragon armor. Oh, dude, I have the best armor. I get the best weapons. You have nothing, man." Well, again, if I just if I put all my time into this one file, then I would pretty much do every side quest, everything, have everything. But I have like six different um, accounts, so uh, let's look in the safe. I, I'm pretty sure I put like these masks in here, and I put like all the dragon bones in here too. So you know, so yeah, that's that's it. He's just getting the last gaze at everything. He's got to get rid of everything. So let's go ahead and start with the uh, armor. So we got shields. This sword. Oh my god, armor. Look at all stuff. All the armor. Got over here. Let's see here. Sword. Come over here. Sword, sword, sword. Put all this stuff in here. I can't get rid of some stuff, so you know. Alrighty, so that is everything out of my inventory, except for the stuff I can't remove. But yeah, that's that's everything right there, and he is completely naked. Has nothing. 
Nothing, nothing at all. So he is deciding. You know what? You know what? First of all, actually, you know what? Let's let's get him. We'll get him some. We'll get him like some freaking, you know, some clothes at least, and equip that. And a hat. I think that'd be good. Yep. So there he is. He's going off on his journey to find enlightenment. And he's off. I'll see you later, Lydia. I'll be back. I gotta find myself. It's a wonderful place. If I do find myself, then I may not be back. You'll never know. Shut up! Shut up! Stupid ass. Alright. So, yep. That's that. I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. Next episode is going to be the departure. And to look forward to that, remember I am playing on Expert and he has nothing. The only thing he has is the Magicka in his mind. So we're going to be going out to the wilderness and trying to survive on Expert with nothing. Hope you guys enjoyed the episode so far. Thanks for watching.